Uh, it was a great day, particularly for Bomber fans. And the Hawks, too, should be pretty happy with their performance as umpire Glenn James a wave to the crowd, and the season is away. First up, Bradbury across to Neagle. This looks dangerous, a long shot at goal. Will it make the distance? It's a goal, I would say. Steve Malaxos will rem re well remember his first kick in VFL footy, a goal. Here's another first. Roger Merritt, reported for wasting time. He will face the tribunal. The question was, did Ian Payton try and play off? Now, let's get down to play of the day. A great performance by Madden. Look at the recovery of the big man as Danaher gets a bad bounce, but in swoops Madden like a rover and puts it through. And if that was play of the day, here's the brush of the day. Look at the strength of the bearded Dippy. Just pushes Neagle away. And goals. And could we call this perhaps Matthews. the miss of the day? Chuck Matthews to Curran, goal. five metres out, across the face and one behind. Other, and what about the throw Very of the day? Or the leap of the day from Malaxos. But no, it is not paid a mark. Up to centre field, looking for Judd. Now the run Hawker of the day. Better judgment gathers it in well. The Bombers, Glenn Hawker. Judd handed out one. Hawker has the ball. Bounces his way down the wing. In pursuit. He tries to get around. Walks here. nicely Just twice, and eventually gets the kick away. He ran a full ten metres. We go into the Van third term. Oh, Vanderhaar. Van a great goal from the right goal. forward pocket. Great courage this time from Peter Schwab. Schwab. Eyes on the ball all the time. And back come the Hawks. Abbott taps Matthews. down to Matthews. Matthews. Always dangerous in front. Yes, it's a goal. The Bombers only kick one goal in the final term. And again, it was the Flying Dutchman, Paul Vanderhaar, coming in to take a great mark. That's really been the steadies and seals the game for the Bombers and perhaps the banners say it all style from the Dons in 85 Fun Factory the happy place open every day from noon the Fun Factory corner of here's another one from Brereton the Bombers, Simon Madden. Madden. Just too much height. Shot at the moment, Pete. Hawthorne defender, Chris Mew. That's his best mark for the day. Back to the Bombers, the, the Flying the Dutchman. The first the for Paul Vanderhaar. Umpire has played the mark. And the second for Paul Vanderhaar. Oh, And as I said, that was part of the action from round three, so they'll be stowed away until we get to the other five games of the third round. Collect <laughs>